With the election 70 days away, Texas Governor Greg Abbott announced that more than 1 million names were removed from the state's voter rolls. This removal process started in 2021 as part of a state law enacted to increase voter integrity. KTSM 9 News reporter Diana Castillo joined us live from our newsroom. And Diana, how is this going to impact you and me? Well, Estela, counties across our state, including El Paso, remove names of non-eligible voters on a daily basis. Now, this includes people who have died, moved out of Texas, or who are not citizens. It's a process that's been happening since 2021. On Monday, Texas Governor Greg Abbott announced that over one million names have been removed from the state's voter rolls. On X, Governor Abbott mentioned in part that among those million, over 6,000 are non-citizens adding that nearly 2,000 of them have voter history. Now, with the election being so close, it's always a good idea to check on your registration status. During uh, big elections, uh, you know, sometimes they show up to the polls and then they find out in person that their voter registration record was canceled. So it's always important to check your voter registration status, especially when you move to a different address within the county or even to a different county within the state. And to check your registration status, you can visit the El Paso County Elections Department website. In a press release sent by the governor's office, it mentions that the Secretary of State's office is in the process of sending all of those voter records to the Attorney General's office for investigation and potential legal action. Back to you.